Hello YouTube and welcome to another Excel tutorial. So in this video I'll show you how you can split multiple data into rows in Excel. So are you ready? Let's get started. So let me show you an example of that. So here I'm opening Excel in Windows. So as you can see here in this example I have only two columns one column called product and another column called origin okay so if you notice in the first row in the second column we have multiple data so the origin of this fruit apple exists for example in morocco france mexico so i want to split the data into this cell into multiple rows okay so for example here into multiple countries so i will get finally each row for each country so how can i do that using excel so in order to fulfill that you have to install another tool provided for free by microsoft okay so you go actually to google and you type download excel power query so i'll click the first link here so it's a tool that you can find in the official microsoft site so here it is microsoft power query for excel so you will choose depending on your version and of course of your language so me i already downloaded this tool here or this extension here it is okay so i'll click in order to install it so here for of course i have to close excel in order to fulfill the installation so let me retry now here we go so i'll just click next i'll accept the term license agreements so let's go and next then install so it's simple process for installing and now i'm ready so what happens here so let's open excel excel 2013 okay so let's click on our example so what happens here so if you notice there is a new tab that has been added called power query here it is so the objective of this video is to split this multiple data cell into multiple rows so i will click on the cell here and i will go to the tab power query here we go so then i will click here from table range and i will get my table into the power query editor okay so i will right click on the cell that i want to split into columns here we go then split column here and of course my data are separated by a delimiter so i will click here by delimiter and i'll go here i i actually here a new dialog has been shown so i will go here i will select the, my delimiter so in this case it's semicolon so if your data are separated by the column you, or comma you can uh, switch to the appropriate delimiter so here there is a lot of delimiters tab spaces so me i have my data separated by a semicolon okay and i will go here to advanced option and here is the option split into columns split into rows so i will just click here into rows okay then i will hit enter or okay and here we go you can see that my cell has been actually divided or split into the number of data separated by a semicolon 
and when finish I will just close and row and load okay and here we go I get my beautiful table here and each data has its own table so using just power query it was quick and easy to do it so remember whenever you have multiple data into cell and you want to split into multiple rows all you have to do is to use this beautiful power query tool okay so as always i hope it has been informative for you and i want to thank you for viewing bye bye